I'm Sir TapTap, and welcome to Let's Play Induction. Review how this game is provided by the developer. Gets into a little loading. This is a neat little puzzle game with a very minimal aesthetic. So we are a box. And we climb up stuff. And we go to the thing. Okie dokie. Oh! It's a cute little level selecty thing. Alright. I see. I've said this before, but I absolutely love games that give little tutorials without actually needing to give you words and stuff. Hmm. What do we do? Oh! I think I know what to do here. Is it that? Nah, it's that. I think. So when we're here, that goes away. No, oh, it didn't have to be perfect anyway. That's an... Very nice little tutorial thing. This is a uh, pre-release build. Um, not sure the release date on this. It'll I'll probably. Oh. Oh, dead. <laughs> okay. I see your central gimmick. Oh, I see. Possibly central. I guess that. What is this? Now I am the cube? Induction, more like Inception. Um, but yeah, this is a pre-release build, so if we hit any bugs, that may be why. Wait, what is... I guess. Huh? Oh, I guess I gotta stay there longer. Right, let's go all the way back. Okay. Hmm. I love those color changes. This is really neat. Alright, go. Come on! Alright, how do I... R is instant restart. Okay. Can I just... Hold X? I think if I hold X, time goes forward faster, so I can... Just spam X to uh, keep myself on that thingy. Yeah, it seems to have worked. Alright. I think this has the potential to get very mind melty. Um, all right, so let's hold on for a bit. So it's one of those. It's it's, it's another one of these self co-op games, but there's always a different little spin on it. Okay. It's like it's time shifted self co-op in this case. Oh, right. I can hold X. I keep forgetting this. Wait. Aw, oh, crap. I have to push it off. Okay. I see. I'm waiting a bit too long, but uh, this is really neat. Oops. All right, I keep forgetting I can do time forward any time. But why am I in this 
different ring. What is... And I can go to a different... Wait, no? No, I can't? Hmm. Mysteries. Alright, let's just keep going. What is this? What is this? Oh! So I see. I really like how it teaches you stuff like that. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Okay. So I need to do... Just that, really. Oh! Wait, pardon? Okay. interesting you can bump into yourself see don't they make these levels where you basically are required to bump into a new problem but uh, the solution is very easy to find out the first time the first way anyway um. hmm? oh don't tell me I have to carry the box on a on a past me Okay. Wait, but no, I'm down here though. Do I have to be the... Curious. Um... Am I supposed to be the one carrying the thing? Push it. No? Excuse me? Why is he dead? Can I just... Hmm. Can I push the other me? Oh wait, I can push it on top of the other one. Okay. Never mind. This isn't as hard as I was making it. Wait. No. Wait. Okay. Now I get it. Eh? Okay. I guess it doesn't matter which one I am. Goodbye, red. Does does which one I am matter? It, like, does that shift which path I'm on or something? I'm a little confused here. What is this? Dead. Okay. Will he climb back up now? 
No, I'm down here now? Wait. If I go to this space, do I warp back there? I'm confused. No? I guess let me try this. Okay. Okay. Achievement unlocked. Two two dots. Maybe they just haven't thought of names for the achievements yet. I'm very confused about the tracks. Like, if I go on the if I win a level as the original color, do I go on a different level track than if I beat it with the other color? Uh oh. I can only do that thing once, so I have to... Og. Okay. Uh-oh. Damn it. Okay. Wait for a second. Push it. Wait for a second. Push it. Okay. Got it. Excuse me? Oh! Wait, I didn't need to- Ugh! Okay, bear with me here. Yes, Barker, bear with me. Ugh! Damn it! I- wait. position am I supposed to be in? It doesn't matter. I messed up. So... Parker! Not now! Come on! Um, not sure I'm doing this right. So... Push it forward. Parker! I think I need to wait. Parker, please! I need to have that block wait. Parky, please! Push that. Wait for a bit. Then continue to push. Alright. Maybe. Oops. Wait. No! Crap. Go back. Move forward. No! There we go. Oop. Hmm? Why is... Ugh. Okay, the rewind's very useful, but it hurts my brain slightly. No! Don't tell me I have to redo all of that because I didn't wait quite long enough. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, now we do this. Wait, no. 
N no, hold on. Okay. Okay. Excuse me? Why can't... Why am I, una I unable to self-terminate? Did... Did... What? I'm not sure what it's telling me here. I have... <clears throat> why can't I push stupid me? Was I supposed to in was I supposed to inception deeper? I can't. Why? But why? There's no reason for you to die. Why did you die? Okay, I go all the way back. Why is that spot? Why? But why? I'm very confused right now. Damn it. Damn it. Why do you die? Why aren't you standing on the spot that I told you to stand on? That... I could freaking swear I told you to stand on the one side of the bridge. Why is it doing this? Uh, did I... Maybe I did make a mistake. Let's rewind and see. No, I did not make a mistake. I'm infallible. How is... what? I, I guess I have to be this one? for it? What is it doing? Why can't I go back to me? Hold up. Uh... Okay, I figured this one out. You know, in puzzle games, sometimes you just kind of need to take a little break and come back with a fresh mind. And then try stuff out. Uh oh, that's actually that's actually not what I wanted to do. So <laughs> I'll just show you. Also, I'm playing this game with a controller now. The controller control scheme makes a lot more sense, in my opinion. Okay. Also, a side effect. Oh, crap. So. I discovered what that is telling you is that your square couldn't move into the position it actually ended on because you bumped it or prevented its progress or something. In this case, it's because we pushed it a little forward when we didn't need to. Ah, crap. So I actually need needed to pause here.
So that should be good. Oop. I actually really like this rewind feature because it uh, allows some really precise stuff that like... Ah, crap. There we go. And now since it's in the right place, we go back to our default state. And we can push that in. And all is well. Um, so an interesting thing I'm noticing about this game is that... Uh, also when I came back here, I noticed this path is open. I'm not sure if that opened because I got stuck. Or if that was open before. I don't think it was open before. So I'm not sure if this game opens up paths if you get stuck or if... Um, I just am not entirely sure how this is working. Uh, but an interesting thing about this game, the how to play it is kind of also a puzzle. I noticed there's no real descriptive text of any kind. And... Oh. Boop. That's not gonna work. Um... It gives you these little hints. Oh, I need to jump off at the right time. But, um, so it gives you hints basically through level design where you kind of have to figure something out in order to proceed, but it never tells you what you're doing. That's strange. So I can't go forward. Like I said, the, the interface itself is also kind of a puzzle with how these things are working out. Cause like, I can't, there's that dot there, but I can't go get to it. And I'm not really sure what that's about quite yet. I'm sure all will be clear in time, but uh, not yet. So this is that weird level that opened up earlier. I'm not I'm not sure when that unlocked, actually. Um, the other thing I was going to say is I'm playing with controller now. The rewind and fast forward buttons make a ton more sense now. It plays fine on keyboard. Um, and their logical mappings and stuff, it's just... Oh! What? All right, and there is a button to skip all the way back. I wonder if I can fall on this thing and then get pushed onto this, and then I'm here, and that's fine. And then I push this back here, and I just stay still. I think this will work. Ah, crap. That is another reason I like the rewind feature. Uh, there we go, I think. I like the trail, too. That is really useful. See, so, yeah, I think I can just run right along and proceed. So that, that last one, <laughs> it wasn't a difficult puzzle like I thought. I just wasn't seeing that color switch thing. So it's like, how to play the game is its own puzzle. Um, oops, Parker. You are going to be trouble, aren't you? You just started the puzzle. I also know I didn't even look at the menu before. It's pretty well hidden, but uh, it's got a decent amount of options here. We've got, you know, typical graphics settings. I mean, not too much more you can do. It, it does let you go over, like, target over 60 frames per second. Uh, does it do specifically 140 or just... Yeah. Just 120. So let's see some audio, effects volume. I don't think there's any audio to, or vocals to subtitle, so that's fine. It lets you map your keys and you can choose your movement skew, which is like, you know, for isometric, um, you know, there's sort of a, two different possible ways to interpret an input. I this, That just lets you pick which one you want to choose, I guess. Disgaea has that option too. It's another isometric game. Turn on grayscale mode. I 
I assume that just that's probably just makes it very clear which uh, color state you're in if you're in the um, I don't know the past or whatever you want to call this yeah I don't I don't need that so I'll just continue right along um what's the deal here oh I bet I need to push it over a bit more. Can I just push it after I'm done? Waste a little time up here. I think this is pretty easy. I, I kind of figured that one wasn't that hard of a level. confused. Why isn't that one? Well... I guess I can go push it down as this one. And then I'll transport to this thing? So, so I just waste a lot of time here? I guess? Hmm. I'm really glad for the rewind and fast forward buttons. It works very well with the sort of puzzles we've got here. I figured I stayed put a little excessively long. Okay. I'm not sure why we didn't switch colors there. But... I guess... I guess it didn't really matter. Hmm? Once again, we end up stuck in the other color. Right, you can just fall off. All right. So Oh, I couldn't do the thing because I was already Calm down. How do I get that to stay? Is it still? No, it's not. Um, I guess if I just stay in that spot for a really long time. Do this? Will this work? And fast forward. Oh, this thing fast forwards for you, right? No, because it's. it, it can't go back up there? 
Wait, no, maybe it's not out yet. Huh? But there's no way you can go back up. You're stuck there forever, you're dead. Wait, hold on, how does this work? What? But I can't. Oh, I can! Okay, so let's reset. fall over. Right? Okay, not too hard. Okay. I, I see. It's never as hard as I make it. Hmm. Probably just sort of one or two more. I don't want to I don't want to end up getting get too stuck. Um, how do I? We see how this is going, and I, if you like puzzles, I would definitely recommend this one. Oh, 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 oh! I see. I love that rewind button so much. Steven Sausage Roll has that too. I uh, that game is too hard for me, but uh, still a very interesting game. I recommend it if you like really hard puzzles. It's just. I don't, <laughs> but uh, visually I love this one conceptually too, but uh, I'm not sure how, um, hmm. how do I get up there? Yeah, I just wouldn't want to continue showing me doing poorly at this because it's Go poorly. Wait. I'm already pretty confused, to be quite honest. Alright, so here. Uh, you're gonna disappear too fast. No! Um. I, I need you to mimic the motions of going into that thing. But how? If I. If I cue those inputs, will it actually attempt to do that? I don't think it will. Okay, that should... Nah, that's not gonna do it. That should result in it. Oh crap, I'm not gonna be fast enough. Wait, no. I picked a good time to stop because maybe I won't finish this puzzle after all. No! Do you go? No, you don't. can I force it to... Do I have to be the one up there? But then what do I do? I don't think I can be the one up there. I lack some words to convey how, like, this game works. Like, which one of me is me, like, at the end of this sec section? I... I really don't get why sometimes I don't... Sometimes I transform back into that one, and sometimes I don't. Um, the level select changed again. Can I go to this level? No? Arc. This is where I could really use like a level... 
skip. Like, what is this? You let me make- you let me complete this level, but I can't continue on. I'm confused. Hmm. I saw this while I'm down here. I can't be up there to do the thing. So. Wait! Wait, wait, wait. What if I need to push it on this one instead? Oh, son of a- <laughs> Of all the stupid things to think. Um. Wait, but then how do- Maybe I needed to give myself more time, though. Wait, no, how do I... But I can't move the thingy down once it's there. <sighs> so, once I'm at this point, what do I do? If I let it drop on my head, I'd... It just falls behind me, right? How do I do this? Nothing useful. Parker, that is solid metal. You can't eat it. Parker, calm down. Um, no! Don't eat the mic. Um... Wait! What if I totally break the timeline? And... Let me wait here for a minute. Then I think I push it over here. But in reality, the other me has already pushed it over and then solved the puzzle like normal. Did I bump it? Okay, if I waited long enough- Oh man, that is clever! I like that! That is... brain hurty, but yeah, that is really cool. Okay. Whew! Waited just long enough. Oh, that is- that is- oh. Okay, I guess you gotta be quick because eh, I guess that makes sense. It's no longer on that space. All right. Oh. Well, now I have to complete this one so I see what's up with these branching, possibly branching paths. Wait, didn't we do one like this? I did one like this, but I'm not sure if I can... How do I get on it? I want... I want him to push me, so that I can get back up. But how does that work? Can I climb on me? I can't. So... I don't think 
this will work. And it did nothing. And if I... If I break the chain... That has no useful effect either. I think this is just basically an error message here. I don't think... I think that indicates a fail state. But I don't see any good coming from this situation either. Why can I go here? Oh man, I just wanted to finish one more. Don't embarrass me, game. I just want to see what the branches are about. I think I need to know what I need to do, but how do I be on the thing when I push it? That's right, Parker. Yes. Wait, can I push him? I can push him. I mean me. I can push me. Right? I can't push me. Me does not be pushed. Um. Wait, okay. Over to... Block him. And he's, he's... He just waits. So that doesn't help. But then what? I obviously need to push myself over to the thing, and then I can press push that switch. What does that? Wait, what does that one do? I can't get to that. Oh. I think I see what I have to do. I have to buffer the inputs. But now what? What does that do? Damn it, you went too far. And then I'm doomed! Baby steps here, tap tap. Um, wait, how did I do that again? Crap. Uh, so. Wait for a while. way to be pushed back into place I think okay let's try this Wait, then I have to push myself. Dang it. Oh, man. 
This is intense. This is very much intense. Alright, so I sit on here for a while. And I get down and push him over and... There you go, I guess? This is really interesting. It gives me a teeny bit of a headache, but um... Oh crap. That's where you're supposed to be. Uh oh, I hope I gave myself enough time to get on there. Okay. Get down! No, no! Ah, oh, I was too fast. No. Okay. Yes! Okay, that, that feels pretty good. So what what is going on with this? I am intrigued. I guess the game doesn't really think you'll get too stuck early on and gives you branching paths later, maybe? I don't know. But, uh... I think that's enough for a... What is this? What? I'm not sure I'll do another video, like, I definitely want to play more of this, but I'm not sure if I want to embarrass myself by recording the whole affair. But, uh, yeah, I'm definitely digging this game. 